Naples today. A man was taken into custody after police say he crashed his pickup truck into a convenience store while under the influence. CBS 4's Riel Creighton is live in Fort Lauderdale with the latest on this, Riel. Well, Carly, the cleanup here at this store is complete, but behind this shutter, it is wide open. Police say the man who busted through this store yesterday admitted to them that he'd had a few beers at home. They were back open early Wednesday morning at this Fort Lauderdale convenience store. Shutters in place of a glass window after a truck came plowing through a day earlier. I wasn't sure, like, it was inside the building or outside. Uh, it was just a big boom, like... Uh, Something, something, something just uh, came came with a good force, you know. The surveillance video captured the destruction seemingly in slow motion as this black pickup careens towards the store, jumps the curb, and comes crashing through the window. A man standing right in front of it. Fortunate for him, at a slow enough speed, the impact is minimal. Police say this was the man behind the wheel, 67-year-old Joseph Wayne Ligas. A CBS 4 camera there Tuesday as Ligas is seen outside the store stumbling through a field sobriety test. According to the police report, when officers showed up, Ligas already out of the truck and they observed signs of impairment. Red bloodshot watery eyes, slurred speech and a strong odor of an alcoholic beverage being emitted from his breath. Under questioning, police say he admitted to drinking two to three beers at home. This truck bulldozed through the store, damaging shelves and groceries. Amazingly, no one was seriously hurt. A store clerk and witnesses telling both CBS 4 News and police, Ligas is a frequent customer. And Ligas did go to jail, charged with DUI. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Rael Creighton, CBS 4 News.